Alright, hello, hello everybody. We got ready up here and casting another Vera Mel match for tonight. Flaming Flamingo versus Lisa. Let's head on into it. Alright, going to see that bounce up there, up to shoulder, up to where Flaming Flamingos is waiting. That will be Poptuna. Poptuna gonna bounce it up above shoulder, gonna get a little swim around shoulder, but there will be the steal right there from Frenzy. A frenzied steal, a frenzied clear. But is the frenzy stack going to be after it? Well, we'll have to see here. Ah, uh, well, we are going to see instead. The frenzy stack will get there. Will be an attempted shot. Will be off the ding ring. Will be a little stun on the goalie there. I'm um, just getting it ready for a three, and it will instead be a two bouncing right off a of cool master poop's hands there. Looks like he might have pulled it in. That is going to be first two points of this round going for lethal. Ninja guys. I am not voting for Flaming Flamingos, they broke my trust, my 2k worth trust. <laughs> oh, Ninja Kai's got let down by uh, Flamingos yesterday, but you know what, I'm always rooting for Flamingos. Um, they are my former team. Um, not in my commentary, I just mean, you know, inside. <laughs> I like to see them do well. But right now we are going to see Flamingos that are going to be a pass over to Cow from Papa Tuna, and now that will be tying us up here 2-2. Two to two. And we are only, uh, how far? About a minute, 20 seconds in, so... Still plenty of time here to see how competitive this match is going to be. Um, we've got Ninja Kai's here. 500 on Lethal, out of spite of Blood and Flamingos. Okay, Ninja Kai's is out for revenge here. Uh, but how are you going to feel when, when you lose Ninja Kai's again? Then will you be back on the side of Flame and Flamingos? I mean, we'll see. Um, well, I say when, if. <laughs> we don't know. We don't know what's going to happen here. I will say what's going to happen he right here is that the, ba uh, the ball, <laughs> the disc is going to bounce up towards Popcorn. That will be a nice little steal there, uh, but it will be off the rebound. Catching it, putting it in, that will be cool, Master Coop. And that will take Flaming Flamingos up to a two-point lead in this first round here. I think I'm going to pull my monitor a little closer to me, as I do when I'm, I'm streaming. Helps me see the names a little better. Alright. We will see here. We're going to follow the disc. That will be right there. Para. Para now looking for a pass option. And. Going to get that pass. Uh, will be a little bit of a strange bounce. Will be coming all the way up. Will be a slap away right there. Over to Lulu. Now Lulu going for the cut pass. Over to Frenzy. And going to put it right past the goalie. And that's going to be another two points there for the Lethal. Getting those lethal cut passes on the Flamingos right here. Tying us up 4-4. Four, four. Hmm. I don't know. That was a pretty good cut. Can we see a good response here from Flame Flamingos? Right, let's see. We'll be coming out of the tunnel. The stack will pass it over to Mozzarella 4, who will attempt to pass it right there to Cow. He's going to miss it at first, but we'll chase it. And we'll go for that pass right over there, over to Mozzarella 4. They're going to go for a cut pass of their own right now, uh, but it will not connect. It will instead come back over towards um, that post right there. Um, my cameras, I'm trying to use the follow cam now in my uh, cams, and yeah, trying to incorporate that as well as everything else I'm doing. It's tough. I'm going to get used to it, though. Oh, and as you can tell, it is tough because I kind of totally messed that one up. Um... <laughs> I mean, the camera kind of slowly swung around to the goal. I wasn't expecting that. 
but um, yeah, that will be another two points there for Flaming Flamingos, giving them the lead now of two points. And uh, still quite early into this first round, six minutes left. All right, now gonna see Lulu. Lulu is uh, gonna look getting that one over to Frenzy. Now Frenzy gonna go for the pass over to Tunnel, just kind of slowly taking this one up the arena. And uh, but it will right there be red and caught by Cow. And now Cow gonna go for a Cow Tastic clear. Uh, will be a little bit of a slap over to Papa Tuna, who's gonna pass that one all the way towards Blue Goal over to Mozzarella Four, who's gonna sink it in before any goal we can get there. That is gonna be another two points going for Flaming Flamingos. Four point lead now. Looking good for him so far. All right. Now yeah, let's see if I can experiment with the cams a little bit here. Will be a pass over, a cross pass over to Lulu. Lulu gonna go for that pass all the way over to Trap. Then will be another cross pass over to Frenzy. And Frenzy's gonna look like he might just take it in. But no, the stop will be right there from Cool Master's Coop. But then the read right afterwards by Para. Para now going to get this pass. And there will be once again Lethal just kind of slowly taking up the field. Going for the cut pass and getting those lethal cut passes that they have already done a few times already. Now only a two point lead for Flaming Flamingos. And. Yeah, a very, very tight match here. I'm not sure who we're going to see win this one. Alright, we're going to see with the possession of the disc, that is Papa Tuna. The Flamey Flamingos now looking to get the pass. Will be the pass over to Cow. Cow now looking for the pass over to Papa Tuna. He's just going to slide right into the right position. Going to juke above everybody get those uh, jumps as it may be or the, the swims but that will not go in that will come back that will eventually be picked up by frenzy and uh looks like that will eventually be cool master coop taking that one away getting that one over to papa tuna getting that one over to cow and getting the bounce shot for the two and that was a very nice bounce shot right there the thing about those shots is that they might not normally be fast enough for the goalie um or to get past the goalie but when it's that quick when it's just pass shot you know that then uh just the reaction time is going to be slow enough where you're not going to see it coming but right now will be frenzy getting that one over to para now para looking for a pass but will be clevered by monster level four and then we will see pocket picks by tuna Tuna now looking to get that one close to blue goal, but no, it will be lethal recovering that one. And lethal, that will be over to the pass to Para. Para passing over to Holy Warrior. Holy Warrior passing it over to Lulu, and Lulu taking it in for the long shot for three. And now we are only at a one point lead for Flaming Flamingos. And I need to mute Discord. You do not need to hear that. All right. Going to be coming out of the two will be Flaming Flamingos with the disc now. Will be we see Papa Tuna getting that one over to Cow Cow. Now looking perhaps for a pass up the shoulder, maybe over to Mots going for the cut, but the stop will be right there from Holy Warrior. That was a holy stop, all right. And then there will be the holy stacks chasing it. Holy Warrior gonna get that one all the way over to uh, orange side here and we will see everybody going for it but it will eventually be frenzy taking that one right away from papa tuna but it will just be a slight ding from a steep angle there and we will see tuna just being there to pick that one up off, off the floor send it all the way to blue side and now we see it is going to go all the way over here will be papa tuna picking this one up papa tuna now looking to get this one in will just be Mots just snatching it out of the hand of a fishing danger there like, you know what, Tuna? I'm not sure I trust you with the disc. It looks like you're going to get your pocket pick, so I'm just going to take it and put it in, and he does, and that's going to be another three points now for Flaming Flamingos. One minute, 40 seconds left in this first round. <laughs> Ninja Kai is just getting a little nervous in chat. He's like, oh no, I bet everything on lethal here. There will be a long shot towards his blue goal. Will be the stacks coming. Uh, the stacks will miss it at first, but eventually will be Para picking that one up. 
and doing a powerful uh, throw there, but it will eventually be recovered right there. Uh, will be slapped up, will bounce up towards Papa Tuna. Papa Tuna going for the pass down bottom, won't connect. Instead, will be intercepted, sent out by Lulu. And it looks like everybody's going to have a fight on Popcorn for it, but eventually picking it up. No, will actually be Frenzy picking it up, stealing it right away from Cow right there. A Frenzy steal from a cow. I mean, just imagine that in your head. <laughs> what I imagine right now is uh, Tuna sending that one over over towards Trap. He is going to get it. It will be a bit of a frenzy for it. Everybody's fighting for it. And it will be a slap all the way over towards Blue Side. We will see a lone Papa Tuna who got the leech and who has enough time to go in for the shot at that steep angle. Great three under pressure there from the stack from Papa Tuna. Now a six point lead for Flaming Flamingos. Only 23 seconds left in this round. So that's certainly going to be that first round going for Flaming Flamingos. Ninja Kai is going back and forth a lot in chat. <laughs> Never mind, they put the L lethal. Wow, lethal. I mean, wow, wait, I mean, wow, Ninja Kai's. You, you bet this much on them, and you're already giving up on them. No, 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 you can't do that. Um, alright. This could absolutely go either way, and I think even up until the last few minutes there, I mean, we saw it was quite close. It was... I believe 12-9 for a bit there. For, like, I think the entire first half of the round, it was quite neck and neck. So, we will see what's going to happen in the second round. Will we see the same thing, maybe? Maybe we'll see somebody take it away. I don't know. But I'm going to be with you right here to see what happens. Um, does look like Lethal lost somebody. Maybe just had to uh, reconnect Wi-Fi issues. Perhaps. I'm just speculating. I got my controller working this time. I found that it's... Yeah, it takes like 10 times to connect it, but I found I can do it sooner if I... While it's trying to connect, like you're just moving it around in like random figure eights and circles, like... It, it will eventually find the right spot if I just move it around slowly and it'll connect. So I'm going to remember that. We do see a pause here. Looks like they uh, waited out the minute in between rounds and then now the pause has started as it looks like we uh, see Lethal just waiting for their fourth teammate to come back here. But they do have a five minute pause, so if they need to use it, they can certainly use it. Be right back here. You need some water.
All right, looks like uh, Lethal got their fourth back here. I am back as well, and I am hydrated. I'm ready for the second round here. Ah, uh, but it looks like players aren't quite ready for the second round yet. They're just uh, going around practicing a little bit. Lethal uh, using up their paws. I'm just gonna listen to the comms for a sec, make sure they're not, uh, you know, waiting for anything specifically. Oh, looks like everybody disappeared and we are gonna be starting the second round. Let's go. Oops, you can still hear their comms. <laughs> Let me turn that off for you. You would not be able to hear them anyway, or, uh, my comments. Uh, anyway. Gonna have, uh, the neutral joust here will be lethal. Winning that one will be a stun out, though, by Papa Tuna. Oof. It just burped. Excuse me. I had some soda. <laughs> um, that will be a pass right over there. Over to Cal. Cal now will be Cool Master Coop with the Cool Master Stun, as he is known for clearing the way for Papa Tuna to take that one on shoulder. The pass from Cal put that in. Two points, starting the round off with a leap of Flaming Flamingos. Move my matter a little, a little bit closer again. Alright, we will be coming out to launch. We will be the pass right there over to Holy Warrior. Holy Warrior now looking for that pass, that cross pass, but it will be with the interception. Pow! Right there. It's gonna be Holy Warrior picking that one up, sending that one. We'll be bouncing all the way over to Valley, but yeah, looks like there will be a bit of a frenzy for that one. As we see, Cool Master Scoop picking it up, and then just the steals after steals after steals right now. Uh, but eventually will be Flaming Flamingos maintaining that possession. Will be Cow right there going for the shot on the goal. Uh, or perhaps a setup that won't work out because it will be Frenzy reading that one. And it looks like Lethal once again lost their fourth, so that might not be too good for them. Uh, you do not want to be in a 3v4 against Flaming Flamingo, but you know what? They are not giving up at all because that's going to be the stack right there from Lethal. The Lethally Fast stack. Putting that one in for two points, that's going to tie us up here. A minute and 40 seconds in. I do wonder if um, Lethal is going to get their fourth back here. I imagine they are, uh, I mean, usually you do see the fourth come back, usually, uh, maybe they need to get their battery pack or, or whatever. Um, but sometimes, you know, they just have to go for whatever reason, and, and they have to carry on with three, and you just gotta accept the way it is and, and fight your hardest. We are gonna see Holy Warrior fighting his hardest to get that one out. We'll be, uh, almost getting that self pass here. Not gonna work out, though. We'll be going for the long shot just a barely a miss from Papa Tuna. We'll be almost floating into the goal, but we'll be the slap away here, the slap of the Holy Warrior. And then, picking it up, we'll be getting on the ceiling. That is Cow. Cow doing some jukes off the ceiling as we kind of watch underneath, and we just kind of stare up at him. Uh, will right there be Papa Tuna now. Papa Tuna getting that one right back up to Cow, who's going to get back on the, sho uh, on the shoulder, on the on the ceiling here. I almost forgot the word ceiling for a second. We know who didn't forget the ceiling, as that is going to be Cool Master Coop. He's going to right up there from the ceiling, chuck it down 18 meters per second into the goal. That is going to be two-point lead again. Flame Flamingos, and it looks like good for Lethal. They did get their fourth back now. So, I mean, they certainly held up pretty well with three, I will say. Um, they were able to score a goal on three, and only uh, that Flame Flamingos scored one of their own. Well, right now, be para. Era taking the disc up slow, looking for that cross pass, getting that cross pass. Over to Holy Warrior. Holy Warrior now looking for that pass right by Gold or Frenzy, but the stop will be right there by Cool Master Coop. What a stop. What a save. And that's going to be right there. What a stack, though, from Lethal. Lethal now. That will be Para. Picking that one up, looking for a pass here, and going to get that pass right near Gold. Over to Cool. Uh, not to Cool Master Coop, but it, it will bounce. Off the of Cool Master Coop looks like into the goal. That will be self goal. Uh, well, I guess it wouldn't bounce off. That'd be a bumper shot. So I guess Cool Master Coop grabbed it and pulled it in, which he's done a few times in the past. Gotta be more careful about that Cool Master Coop. Uh, but I understand that's that's a common thing to happen to goalies. 
um, especially when it's just so close and oftentimes it, it would have gone in anyway. Uh, but right now, going to be Mott's looking for that pass up to Papatuna. Will he go for the pass down to Cool Master Group? The stack will be right there to read it. On the side of Leithling, are going to chase it. Will not read it, though, because that is going to provide an opportunity for Flaming Flamingos to slap that one over into Valley. Will be Papatuna getting that one, getting that one quite close. Blue goal, but won't go in. Will be stopped by the defense. Right there, we'll be going for an anchor shot. Tuna almost in the bottom pocket, but just bounces back. Will be Flaming Flamingos maintaining the disc possession right now. And right there, be Cool Master Coupe pass right over there. The Papa Tuna, who's going to get it right past the stunned out goalie. And that's going to be yet another two points here for Flaming Flamingos 6 4. All right. All right, we'll be coming out of the tube here. We got Lulu. Lulu now getting that pass right over to Frenzy. Now Frenzy gonna look for a pass option here. And it looks like that will be the pass right there over to Holy Warriors. Gonna get it right near Orange. Oh, Lulu almost taking it in, but the save will be right there by Papa Tuna. And what a save! And what a reaction after that save. Just quickly getting above goal, clearing that one out. And the stacks will be right there from Flaming Flamingos, providing the opportunity for Cool Master Cube to put it right past the lone goal who had just arrived. Wasn't able to stop it. Cool Master Cube was just too close for him. That's gonna be. A uh, four-point lead right now for Flaming Flamingos with four minutes left in this second round here. First round victory, as a reminder, did go over to Flaming Flamingos, so if they win this round as well, we uh, that will be it for the match. But perhaps you can see Flaming Flamingos as well. How uh, you wait? Uh, lethal take it for a, a round three. Anything can happen here with almost four minutes left. But right now we are going to see Tuna. Tuna picking that one up, getting that pass, but not. Connecting instead will be the fling of Flamingos stack chasing it. I kind of merged the name here for a second. It has many syllables, Flaming Flamingos. It is quite the mouthful. Uh, right now, we'll be Lulu getting that pass right over there to Holy Warrior. Gonna get the Master Frenzy, gonna go for it, and it will be a slam dunk there. Doesn't go in at first, gets stopped, but Lulu is just right there to grab it, push it in there, and that will be uh, now only a two point lead for Flaming Flamingos. So, once again, just a very close match. We go through here, coming out of the tunnel. That will be Papatuna getting a nice little duck on the enemy right there. Will eventually be a pass over to Cow. And now Cow just gonna look for the cross pass here. Uh, looking for an optimal bounce, but it will not be an optimal bounce. Instead, it will be Frenzy getting that pass up to Holy Warrior in the goal, who's going to send that pass down to Para, who is waiting. Para now going to send that one, will be bouncing right off bottom trends, perfectly setting up Lulu right there, but doesn't go in, does go off the ding ring, provide the opportunity for Papa Tuna to send that one out, but it will be the recovery right there from lethal getting the pass just in time to that's where we was able to put that one in for two points and now we got a tie match we have seen quite a few um close shots off the ding ring uh this this match uh where the setup was great it was either open goal or the goalie was stunned but it was barely missed uh, i think if we saw those go in we'd see we'd be seeing a different match right now Although I'm not sure, I didn't keep count, so I don't know how different it would be. Uh, but instead, this is going to be, this will be Mozzarella getting that pass right up there over to Cow. Cow not going to get the pass up to Papatuna, who's going to go for the shot on the goalie. And yeah, when the goalie is distracted, you need to make sure that those uh, people looking for those shots are covered. Because if they're not covered, the goalie's done, they're getting it past that goalie. Alright, that will be two point lead now for Flaming Flamingos. Will be right now coming out. That will be lethal. Sending that one, it will bounce all the way over into the tunnel. It will eventually be Cow catching up to it, going for the shot all the way from tunnel while pressured just before being stunned. Cow, let's go. What a shot. What a shot.
And that shot might actually seal the deal here because we only have a minute left. It's certainly possible for Lethal to come back here, but they would need to score at least two goals here. And one would have to be a three-pointer. And that's going to be hard to do when we see uh, Flame Flamingos gain possession of the disc. Almost make a shot here. Will not go in. Will be stolen away right there by Frenzy. Will be the lethal stack chasing after it here. Looking for the shot. But again, we're just seeing dings upon dings upon dings from everybody. Um, will provide the opportunity right there for Tuna to grab that one. Send it all the way over towards Tunnel. Looks like right now going to be Mozzarella 4. Sending that one all the way close to Blue Goal. And we're certainly past it. Uh, mathematical time here so it will be a flame of Flamingos victory but what can we see here in the last few seconds we can see a little bit of a bounce back perhaps going for a pass that was lethal but we'll get slapped back again there will be a lot of slaps going on slap after slap after slap right now but after the little slap fest is done well we're gonna see that pass over the cool master coot and that is gonna seal the deal that is gonna be 15 a flame of Flamingos in that second round and what a match. What a match. Because, yeah, for most of that first round, most of that second round, it was just so tight the entire time. Just neck and neck. Uh, and then I think in both rounds, we saw near the end, Flynn Flamingos just taking it away uh, as, far as, as far as shots go. But, yeah, let's look at these stats right here. I mean, we saw a nice, you know, just even spread around the board from, from everybody. Um, well, we don't see Paris ac accurate stats because you have to rejoin there. But uh, you know, just a uh, nice even stun count for most people. You see Papatuna getting a lot of those shots. As we have seen, he hits those threes quite well. And if you watch the Echo Friendly 1v1 Cups, like the one that matched the other day, you know he hits those long threes for sure. Um, but yeah, just great stuff from everybody. We've got everybody leaving now, so I can't look at the stats anymore than I already have. Um... But, yeah, I hope you all have enjoyed. Ninja Kai's, are you still here? <laughs> I, I imagine Ninja Kai's is not too happy because he, this has been the second loss in a row after quite a long win streak. Hey, you win some, you lose some, Ninja Kai's. Um, yeah, but hope you all enjoyed. We'll certainly have more VRML uh, matches coming for you soon here. Maybe uh, tomorrow, the next day. Some time like that, I'm not sure. I never really know in advance. But, yeah. It was a good match, and anything else I wanted to say? I guess I, I still need to set up those channel points rewards. I'm going to try to do those soon. Uh, also, we will have a, another tournament coming up uh, in Echo Friendly soon, the server that I run. So if you want to join uh, that, go ahead. In my bio, there's a, a link to the server. Um, anybody in chat here? Sam wants you to cast. Um, well, I do start work in about half an hour, Mott, so I, I don't think I can cast that, because didn't he say it was, like, in an hour from now? Yeah, so. Not going to be a possibility tonight, but uh, usually early week is best, because those are the nights that I, that I have off. All right. That has been Flaming Flamingos versus Lethal. Great effort from both teams, and congratulations to Flaming Flamingos. All right, if you like my casting, you want to see more of it, feel free to hit that follow button, and you can get notified the next time that I go live. Thanks for watching, everybody. You have a good one.